Yo, first of all, I just want to say, I don't even know if this, like, mic is picking it up or anything, but behind my house, there's, like, a business pretty close by, and they're playing, like, some slaps, some music, so hopefully that's not, like, distracting or anything, but I'm here in my backyard, obviously, <laughs> and, um, I'm just kind of hanging out. I'm actually about to smoke a little bit, drink a little bit of cider before I get started on this project right now because I've had like a very long day, but I want to get this done and I feel like this will kind of make it more of like a relaxing hangout instead of like a thing I have to do on my to-do list. Um, before I get into that, like the relaxing, um, let me tell you what's going on here. Weird title, I know, if it's what I think I'm going to put it as. Um, basically, I got this thing in the mail. And it was a survey, and it said basically like, what is what do trees mean to you? Did you used to you know climb trees? Did you have a tree house growing up? Um, do you like plants? Do you like wildlife? Do you like animals? And of course, I said yes, yes, yes. I love plants. I love animals. I had a tree house. I love climbing trees, um, and it had all that stuff. And I was like, what is this? What are they going on about? And then at the end, they said, for taking, since you took the survey, you can have a few different options. It said, um, I'm forgetting what the options are, but it was a few different options of different types of plants. And it was basically one big bush of like beautiful flowers, um, a few little trees. And uh, I think one was like just entering to win a Kindle or something like that. And I was like, okay. I don't even know which one I chose, but I think I chose the flower one. I think I chose a, I chose a big bush, bushy flower plant or something, a flowery tree. And I was like, great, I got a free, I got a free thing. And they said, okay, hop over to the website, put in your mail, mailing address and shit, and we will send that out to you. So I go over there, and at the very end, it says, you know, uh, would you like to donate? And I thought that was a fucking question. But tell me why it was kind of a, a, a prerequisite to getting my gift. And who had to sneeze? Okay, it's not coming out. And so I had to, I literally had to pay, like, add a tip them or whatever, give, give a donation in order to receive my free plants. And you know what? I did it. I donated, I think it was $20, and I think that was the minimum. Like, they wanted some real money from me. Um, I don't know exactly what this company does. It's, like, for the city or something like that, and it's supposed to, like, I don't even know what they do, but it's something, obviously, related to planting trees and whatnot. And so I gave them their money, and I thought that, like, and they, this was months ago, like, maybe six months ago, and they told me they would ship it out in spring. And I thought that I was going to be like some big ass, you know, bushy, like they said, a big ass bushy plant and flowers. Bro, tell me why this is what I got. This is my plant. I don't see, I mean, obviously plants grow. And I'm sure that when I open it, I'll see that it is a plant or whatever. But like, bro, why did I think I was getting a legitimate, like, I thought a truck was going to pull up. I mean, I don't know. I guess for $20, this makes sense. But let's open it together because I haven't opened it. It says, live plants, plant immediately. If not ready to plant, open to read the planting guide for storage instructions. Um, and so it's with Arbor Day Foundation. Uh, yeah. So pretty interesting. Okay, so it says I got 10 flowering. I got 10 flowers and two Two of something else. I don't even know what the fuck this is. Um, yeah, pretty interesting. I got some trees. Let me open it. Very excited to see what's in here. This literally just was delivered a few hours ago. I also don't exactly know where I'm going to put it. I have, like, so much work to do on my yard. Like, it's crazy. I don't even know anything about yard work. But I'm going to do my best. It's going to take me some time. I was going to do some gardening today, like getting rid of more weeds and whatnot. But if you didn't see my most recent, like, yard work video I made, um, 
basically I love weeds, I love plants, I love anything growing, but my ADU, the dude who rents my ADU said he is having some allergy issues, but I actually am too now, so now I get it. Um, so I have to get rid of some weeds, and there's weeds everywhere. Oop. Okay, what did I get in here? I got, it says, please read. Look serious, so there, here are, um, here are my plants. Why is this hella funny? This, this, they're scamming. They're scamming out here, guys. I also got a, a free tree book. Nice. Oh, so other trees that they have for sale. It says free shipping and handling for any order over $75. Yeah, that's a scam. That's a goddamn scam. Okay, so let's see what this thing has to say. says don't use fertilizer keep them watered for the first year keep the soil moist but not soggy that's easy in our in uh, Oregon here separate them okay cool it just said unpack the trees um, soak them in water for three to six hours Dig a hole wider than seems necessary. Pop that bitch in there. Put some dirt on it. Throw some water on it. Okay. Put some mulch on top. It says it's mulching is important in the fall. Oh, okay, in the fall, okay. Interesting. I don't know shit about this. So I'm glad they gave a little... Little thing here. I don't like the soaking in it. I don't like the soaking for three to six hours thing. Because I don't got time for that. Should I soak it, guys, or should I just do it? <laughs> okay. I'm going to chill out. I'm going to drink a little bit of cider, smoke some weed real quick. Of course, I got my bong. I don't think I'm going to wait the three to six hours. I think I'm going to just try to separate them and do it. I'm annoyed because I got this big ass pot ready to go. I did decide that I am just gonna pop this guy in some water. I'm gonna do what they said. Three. I'm gonna do what the uh, package says and just let them soak for three to six hours. And tomorrow I will plant them. Um, or later tonight. I might just come out later tonight because I have time. Um, and so I got this big ass pot ready to go. And like, the one time I need a pot with no hole at the bottom, I can't find one. I swear, whenever I need a pot with a hole, I can never find one. But it's the opposite this time, of course. Um, so this is like the only thing I have. It's just like a little jar, and it looks like it will be big enough. So I'm going to go fill this guy up with water for my hose real quick and just throw him in here. Water. I got the water ready to go. Hey, Cheddar. Um, all I got to do is put them in here. So let's do it. What's up, Chetty? Look at how small this one is. What a little baby. Alright. All that gooey, that gooey stuff. I don't even know if that is. Oh, wait. I need to undo this. Great. All right, now I'm going to go and pick a spot and dig a hole so that later tonight I can be just fully ready and I can just put them in the, in the ground. 
So I'm not even sure where I want to put it. Hmm. Well, I'm choosing this spot. And I'm choosing this spot because it's like a flower bed right here. Oof. Stuff just went in my eye. But it's like a flower bed, and I really cannot tell whether this stuff is weeds or not. But there's a lot of weeds or whatever going on over here. But right here is a nice, ooh, so strong smell in here. <sighs> um, a nice spot right here for, um, for this big, beautiful plant. I'll just have them, like, lined up kind of right here so i'll make a huge ass hole and well actually i'm thinking do i put them in different holes i'll just make one long hole and just kind of put them all right next to each other i don't really know how far apart they should be this probably should have mentioned that but anyways i'm gonna start digging this boy up Well, I would say that was a success. I think that I did a pretty good job. I just, you know, mad I have to wait a few hours, but I just put on a reminder on my phone to come back out and just throw them in and then just put the dirt on top. It should be easy. Um, I just have to remember to keep it watered. But it does get hot here in Portland, but not crazy hot or anything. Ooh. But... That is it. Um, let me know if you like some gardening videos. I obviously have so much work to do in my yard, and um, I don't know. I can make I can make videos of doing it, but if not, I probably won't. I'll just do it and then show you the after the uh, you know whatever I, I fucking end up doing. But yeah, I definitely will be having to make updates on these trees i really hope that they grow into what they say they will big beautiful bushes what's up chetty you have anything to say cheddar um but yeah that's it thanks for watching i'm about to finish this cider smoke a little bit more weed and chill the fuck out that's it bye you something to say cheddar